Crude oil comes from the decay of organic matter, like plants, that deposited in rock sediments millions of years ago. Over time, and under the right temperature and pressure conditions, this decaying organic matter converted to what we refer to as crude oil or hydrocarbon. Crude oil is a mixture of carbon and hydrogen-based molecules of various sizes and shapes. These molecules can be straight, single-bonded carbon chains called paraffins, or if they are branched, they are referred to as isoparaffins. If the straight chains have double bonds, they are called olefins. There are also molecules in the shape of rings. Single-bonded rings are referred to as naphthenes. Rings with double bonds are referred to as aromatics. Crude oil often contains contaminants such as sulfur, nitrogen, nickel, and vanadium, which are a natural part of hydrocarbon reservoirs. Sulfur and nitrogen contribute to environmental emissions when burned in your car's engine. In addition to sulfur and nitrogen, metals like nickel and vanadium poison refinery catalysts and must be removed during processing. Crude oil quality differs from reservoir to reservoir. Petroleum and process engineers classify crudes primarily based on two properties, API gravity and sulfur content. API gravity is a measure of the density of the crude. The lower the API gravity, the higher the density of the crude. Lower API gravity crudes have a greater portion of larger molecules versus smaller molecules in their mixture. Higher API gravity crudes have a greater portion of the lighter molecules versus heavier molecules. API gravity is an indicator of the ease of processing of a particular crude oil in refineries. Typically, higher density, lower API gravity crudes are more difficult to refine and therefore are cheaper to buy. Sulfur is another major factor considered when evaluating crudes. Crudes are classified as sweet if their sulfur content is less than 0.5 weight percent. Crudes with sulfur content higher than this are referred to as sour crudes. Because sulfur content is a contributor to environmental emissions, refiners must incur greater costs when processing sour crudes because sulfur must be removed below the legal limit. Therefore, sweet crudes sell at a premium to sour crudes.